Hey everyone, welcome back. I came to Walgreens to grab some of the deals. This is a sales week of April 18th through April 24th. On my account, I got a spend booster for spend 50, get $7 in Walgreens cash, which I don't think I'm gonna do that. Um, with all the scenarios that I put together, I was having like a pretty high out of pocket and I don't really wanna spend that much cash today. So on my husband's account, I got a spend 25, get $5 in Walgreens cash. So I'm gonna do that one. I think I'm gonna build my total up to around $50 so I can roll $20 in Walgreens cash and have a lower out of pocket. Um, I'm really excited about the Dove deal here at Walgreens. I did get a CRT for CVS for buy three, get $6 off. And I think this week it's buy three, get $5 extra care bucks. And I think the deal's better here. So I think I'm gonna do that deal twice, obviously on two separate transactions so that my register reward will print for both. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it to the store, show you what I'm grabbing, and then we'll go over the final numbers. So this week Dove is on sale for $6 and when you buy two, you get a $4 register reward. So I'm gonna pick up one of these, it's gonna be $6. And then I'm gonna pick up a men's over here. So both of those is gonna bring me to $12. We did get this buy one, get one free. So when you buy the women's, you get a free men's. This came out in today's 418 Unilever insert. So $12 minus six, it's gonna be $6. You'll get back that $4 registry reward for buying two, making your final cost a dollar for each one. I'm gonna grab also some Dial Body Wash. These are on sale this week, two for $7. And then we got this dollar off of any one that came out in today's 418 save insert. Um, if you can find the Clean and Gentle, there is a rebate on Ibotta. They're all sold out here. This is a better rebate because it's $1.50 for each one. But I'm still going to grab two of these for a dollar back on Ibotta. So $2 will come off, leave me to pay $5. i will get back $2 on Ibotta, making my final cost $1.50 for each one. I'm going to pick up two of these Gillette Foamy uh, Shave creams i believe that's what these are so they're buy one get one 50 percent off buy two get a four dollar register reward so one's going to be 2.99 the second one will be 149 both of them will bring me to four dollars and 48 cents i'm going to go ahead and pick up two with no coupons i'll get back the four dollar register reward making it 48 cents for two so there are a couple promotions going on with the Oral-B and the Crest this week. There are certain ones that are priced at $3.99 and when you buy three, you get a $6 register reward. And then there are some that are priced at $3.00 by two, get a $4 register reward. I'm not gonna do this one because this is the same deal as the Dove promotion. So if you do both of them in the same transaction, you will only get one $4 register reward. So I'm gonna come down here and pick up this one. $3.99, I'm gonna pick up three for $11.97. I have a $5 off of three digital that'll leave me to pay $6.97. I'll get back the $6 register reward, making my final cost 97 cents for three toothbrushes. This week, Downy, Tide Simply, and Bounce are on sale for $2.95. Buy four, get a $4 register reward. So I'm gonna pick up two of the Downy and two of the Tide Simply. That's gonna bring me to $11.80. I have a 50 cent off of one digital that'll leave me to pay $11.30. I'll get back the $4 register reward, making my final cost $7.30 for four or $1.82 each, which is not a bad deal. This is everything I'm going to do in the first transaction. Subtotal here is $47.25. I'm going to roll $20 in Walgreens cash. That'll bring me down to $27.25, which is still over the $25 to get me back that $5 in Walgreens cash. So I'm going to go ahead and cash out and I'll tell you guys what I got back in rewards and what I should get back for my bottom. Okay, so I made it back in from the store. I didn't show you my second transaction. I just got two more Dove products, uh, Body Wash Women and the Body Wash Men. So on my first receipt, here are the Gillette Foam. They're buy one, get one 50. Here are the Dove products, the Oral-B, three at 11.97. Two of the Dove for seven. Um, the Tide Simply products, I got two of each, so they just rang up for 5.90 for two. So all of, uh, I had three manufacturer coupons. If you didn't buy today's paper or you're not gonna get the inserts, um, we do have a two off of two dial in the Walgreens app. If you guys have it, you can use that if you don't have the dollar off of ones. I had the five off of three digital and the 50 cent off of one downy or tied. Um, everything came off as it was supposed to. It was it worked awesome. So my subtotal was 33.75, which is quite high. So I told you guys I was gonna roll $20 in Walgreens cash. So with my tax, I paid $17.53. Uh, my subtotal was 13.75. And then I got back 
$5.27 in Walgreens cash, $5 for spending $25 and then $0.27 cents for everything else. And then I got back $18 in register rewards, everything printed as it was supposed to. Here's four. Um, register reward deals were the Gillette, the Oral B, the Dove, and the Downy. Um, I don't really know which is for which. Here's a $4 for P&G, $4 for P&G, $4 for P&G, which is 12 and then I rolled the $6 register reward from the Oral-B into my second transaction, which I will show you guys right now, and then this is just a 20% off of your next $10 purchase, um, regular priced items. So there's that, and then my second trend, okay, let me finish going with this. So, um, $13.75 subtotal, and then I got back another $2 from Ibotta, $5.27 in Walgreens cash, $18 in register rewards. Two dollars on Ibotta for twenty-five twenty-seven back, and then my subtotal. I'm gonna include my Walgreens cash because technically it's you know if you guys don't have it, then you would have to pay the thirty-three seventy-five if you did this. Um, that makes this final cost eight dollars and forty-eight cents after registry rewards, Walgreens cash, and I bought a rebates. Um, second transaction was just two more of the Dove, so I roll. Where is everything? So I had the Dove manufacturer coupon and then I rolled the $6 registry reward from the Oral-B. So the Oral-B is a P&G product and I was kind of nervous. I wasn't sure if the other uh, registry reward was gonna print, but it did. It's right here and Dove is a Unilever product so it printed just fine. I don't know if, if that has anything to do with it. All I know is if you use, like if I used the $4 registry reward from the Dove that I previously bought, this one would not have printed. So I used another one. So I paid only tax, so 96 cents, so my subtotal was zero. We're going off the subtotal. And I got 12 cents in Walgreens cash and a $4 register reward. So I lost $2 in register rewards. So my first transaction was $8.48 and my second transaction was $2. So $10.48 for all 15 items that I picked up. That makes everything about 69 cents each, which is not a bad deal. I'm happy with all the body wash I got. When I had my um, stockpile yard sale, I sold like 95% of my body wash, so I need to stock up on some more. I probably would do another one in like three months when I grow, I have to obviously grow my stockpile back up. I've been out of town for like a month straight, I feel like. So it does bring us to the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. I did not use, or I did not do the spend 50, get $7 in Walgreens cash. I have a lot of register rewards, but obviously when you use register rewards, it kicks off your digitals. So if I can come up with a scenario, to only use paper coupons with my register rewards and still have a low out of pocket from items. Maybe I will come back to Walgreens, but I'm not sure. I'm kind of happy with what I got already for the week, and then I have register rewards for next week. So it does bring us to the end of this video. Again, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.